is Jennifer Roberts, and today we're going to talk about the Dwight County 4-H Shooting Disciplinary School. They offer archery and rifle, and today we're going to talk about the shotgun disciplinary of trap shooting, as you saw Lily demonstrate at the beginning of this video. So what you would need to play a game of trap would be preferably a 12-gauge shotgun, ammunition, eye and ear protection are required. A shooting vest or a pouch to carry your ammunition and your spent shells. And then finally, your clay targets. A complete game of trout consists of 100 shots. It's broke down in four 25 shot rounds that is in a rotation through our five stations as you can see on our field. The shooter will then call for their clay target to be thrown from the trap house by saying, pull. <laughs> to score a game of trap, it is one point for one broken clay. Now, this is a game that you can compete with your teammates against another team, or you can compete against your teammates, but you really compete with your biggest competitor of all, yourself. Pull. Now that's how you play a game of trap. On our introduction day, we would cover things like our gun and safety rules we would introduce you to your gun. Let me show you map. M is for our muzzle. A is our action. And T is our trigger. All guns will have safeties, but the safest gun that you'll ever see is one that has an open and visible action. We'll go over other things like our gun cleaning and maintenance a choke selection for your gun, and even a shooter stance. So I encourage you to come check us out. If you need, call the local UT Extension agent for more information. Thank you. You have a good day. To the success of our shotgun program, we would like to thank our coaches Jennifer and Cody Roberts, our parent volunteers, and to our sponsors, Whitman Life, Teresa Wilkery, Bargain Supply Warehouse, Middle Tennessee Natural Gas, Kevin Smith, Jimmy Clark, Gary Maxwell Insurance, Jeff Swatty Shop, Sparta Block and Tank Supply, Exceed Limits, and of course, friends of NRA and UT Extension. Thank you.